What's up everybody? Blue Gabe. We are in Jamaica. This is our good new friend Raj who owns a uh, YouTube channel Spearfishing Jamaica. I'll have everything about him at the end of this video. And this is our new friend Shark Boss. We are here to go catch mud crabs. But if this is the first video of mine that you've watched, go back and check out my latest video, Giant Crawfish and Prawns, that I did with Raj and my girlfriend Kelly, who's behind the camera, yesterday, way up in the mountains in the most beautiful river I've ever seen. They're the biggest crawfish I've ever seen, the best tasting crawfish I've yeah, ever seen. Definitely. Probably the best dish I've ever ate in my life, Raj cooked right there on the side of that river. But today's video is mud crabs. What are we gonna do? We're gonna go over um, in the swamp and hunt them on the river banking so we can get some fishes in the like taking them out of the habitat in the In the swamp. So yeah. he said we came all the way to Jamaica to go to the swamp. <laughs> Where we live is a swamp. We were yeah, hoping uh, we were hoping uh, for beautiful beaches and lounge chairs and being able to relax, but no. <laughs> right behind us is a swamp that looks like it's infested with mosquitoes, thorn bushes. Crocodiles. Crocodiles, <laughs> and he nah. said there's deer here. So the deer gets too close. <laughs> We're having deer meat for dinner, if y'all know what I mean. Cook, yeah. So, hey, I'm glad y'all are here. Kelly, my girlfriend, whose channel is called Kelly Young, she's also doing some amazing videos while we're here. So be sure to check her channel out. Now, let's get started, y'all. Okay, you guys. Oh. My OSHA approved work boots are coming off. We've got the machete. And we're already seeing signs of commercial fishing. One thing about these nets right here, no matter where you go in the world, those nets are responsible for the lack of the fish in our oceans. But here in Jamaica, that's the way they make their income, so, so be it. When in Rome, do as the Romans. As you can see, we're about to bail off in this swamp, and there's no telling what we're getting into. So we're probably going to switch off my big camera, go to GoPros, and get bitty get bit get crabby whatever we're going in there get bit by a crab you get him yeah, we already got one look at the tilapia bed oh what well, water's cold ah! oh. son you oh you get him How did you see him? I actually saw him at uh, uh, his toes. <laughs> I didn't really see him. You saw his bubbles? Yeah, his toes and stuff. Y'all see these little things right here? That's crab poop. This is uh, actually a small man. Come on, babe. We're crossing? Yeah. Ooh. I'm sinking. Where's your arm? Don't take me with you. <laughs> oh, man. Come to Jamaica, they said. It'll be real easy. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I got to get my bearings and figure these crabs out because the Jamaicans are already one up on us, and that can't happen. The mosquitoes are real. So we gotta we gotta take a minute and explain what Don't the move. what is it? A Don't big, move. Oh my gosh. A big spider? Oh my goodness, yes. A massive one on your shoulder right now. Well get him off. Oh god. Here's the machete. Just don't cut me. Oh hold on. They said they didn't have spiders. Oh my here. god, it's so big. Okay, well get him off. Okay, he's off. I got one. Oh my god. Alright, we gotta go over here and check this crab out. Man, this jungle's legit. <laughs> yeah, that's nice... Alright, well we got crab number two. The next one we're gonna have to show y'all how we catch them. Or how they catch them, because I haven't caught one yet. <laughs> oh! <laughs> 
Babe, squawk. Squawk lightly, babe. Ow, there's a branch in my cojones. All right, you guys, we got to get quiet now. Oh, I see him. Oh, he just went in the hole. Whoa! That's so I'm stuck! Right here! Right there in the hole! Right there! Let's see. Hold on, try. I got... I'm still stuck in the mud! Alright. That's nasty mud. Where did he go? In this hole. He's gone back way out here. Let's see. Try it. Dang, the hole's deep. It goes straight down. Yeah. Well, we failed. <laughs> Babe. Yeah. Did you sign up for all this? When you step right there, you're about to disappear. So where are we going? This way? Yeah. Hey, Raj, why the last video I see you make, you were in like sugar cane and it wasn't so hard. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> I can't. There's leeches in here too, babe. Stop. They get in your Stop. pants. It's bad. So we're easing through this swamp looking for these crabs. But it's not like deer where they're moving around. They're just sitting there. And the second they see you, they shoot into their hole. And as you can see from that last one, their hole can be pretty deep and you can't get to them. So we're not doing a ton of talking because we're actually trying to be stealthy. He said deer live in this swamp too. That's pretty neat. There's a great big one right up here. Now I gotta find out where he went. Oh, right there. <sighs> Talk about a spot and stalk. I just spotted you and stalked you. Mud crab style. That's pretty cool. This one doesn't have any claws though, so we're going to turn it loose. This is very scary. Right there, there's a big one, and I got to stick my hand in there. Oh! Oh boy. That joker is in there. Tried to break my thing. Ow! <laughs> no! Get it off! Get it off! Babe, uh, this one has wrecked me. Nice one Look, there. he's legit breaking it right now, I think, babe. Oh, 
Oh, your fingertip. Yeah, he's got the fingernail and all. Oh, oh you got it. Look at you. I'm really oh, Somebody bring that bag. bag. Just hold him over it and he'll drop. Hold the bag. Gosh. <laughs> the torture brother. <laughs> We're trying to catch one big one for a thumbnail. I mean, look at that. Where he just flattened my thumb. He broke his claw off and was still biting me hard. I got him out of that hole though. He lost the battle. He's got you? Oh, oh. oh crap. Oh babe, come right here and catch him with your left arm from my angle. I can't, I can't the thing is I can get my arm in there, but I can't pull it. You him can out. from up here. Okay, I got a good grip on his body now. Oh, don't get me with that finger. Don't pinch me. <laughs> I couldn't go out. Oh, oh my God. Oh. 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 Babe, that was quite the roar you just did. I can't get her out. Oh. Hold on. Oh. 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 <laughs> <laughs> right there, look at me and smile. Babe, she's got oh. eggs. She's full of eggs. Oh. I think, oh wait, is that dirt? Uh, uh, ow. Oh, she's a female. We got to turn her loose. You can keep that claw for good luck, though. She got your finger? Uh-huh. Hmm. I got to wait till she releases my finger, because... I would just let, set her in the water and she'll let go, probably. All right, I'm sorry. You can just go back. Oh man, my my pointer finger is ruined. <laughs> Here, all that for one claw. I just, I mean, there's, I just let him pinch me. I couldn't grab him without, I'm just like, just pinch me. That way it can't get away because it's trying to pinch me. <laughs> so I just let him pinch me. <laughs> Kelly Young caught her first mud crab and we are officially having mud crab for dinner. This is intimidating, I'm not gonna lie. Big gloves, you can let him pinch it. Oh gosh, right here, babe. Whoa. Oh, Oh god, I'm definitely getting bit. Yeah, you are. Sacrifices must be made. Oh boy. Oh. All right, here we go. There you go. Good job. Whew, unscathed. Is this a good one? Yeah. Yeah, I'm on. Ah, uh, got him. Uh, nice one. Yep. Awesome. Good. I think he's looking for more crabs. Good one. Oh yeah, I caught you creeping. Oh no, it's a female. Crap. I just caught one on the tree. Female though. Yeah, I'm on. See you later, girl. You guys, look what old shark bite just caught. Yeah. Oh. Hey. Yeah. You guys, we've been catching medium sized to large sized females. I just had one, a really big one too, but it ended up being a monster female. You get him? Yeah. How come I've caught 40, but I ain't caught a male yet, and you <laughs> catch the big males? There's a big one in here. Oh no, he's... Right here. Right here. Oh no. Oh gosh, he's about to bite me. Over here on the left side. On your left? Yeah. No, now you're, this side. You're right. I... <laughs> Come here, shark bite. Yeah. Come here. Raja, stick your hand in this hole over here. I got him on this side, but I can't pull him out. 
feel it, I have inclined. Hey! Oh, what's that? <laughs> playing hard to get. Right, right here. Let me dig right here. Uh-uh, I got it. Let me dig right here. Let me get it. Oh, there's a big one. There we go. <laughs> the mud crab. That is so freaky doing this. <laughs> Look at that. Hey, that was my thumb. I feel his thumb in there and I went, wham, I pushed down on it. <laughs> 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 it's it's muddy. Must be a all right, I'm getting out of here. Let's go to the beach real quick. Yeah. All right, all my Florida peeps, Louisianians, Mississippi, Alabama, South Carolina, all of us that have swamps, all the way up the Northeast. That swamp right there is nasty. But our beaches at home can't compare to this one right here. And it's right next to the swamp. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Open that bag for a sec, babe. All right, so we just got to where we're gonna cook. We left the beach because the wind was blowing way too hard. We have to come down this really, really steep hill hillside and then across these slippery rocks, across this one deep spot, and we're gonna cook right over there. Ow! <laughs> the only problem is we gotta jump from here to there without slipping. What you think, shark bite? Huh? Look at Kelly coming down backwards. Why you gotta cook in such hard places? I didn't pick this place, Raj did. All right, you guys, so we got this fire started. It took us about 10 minutes to let it get to where it was the temperature that he wanted. We've added some sea salt into the river water. We just filled this pot up with the water right out of that river. And we're going to start adding some seasoning, some of these no local Jamaican seasonings. Ghost peppers, which I was so scared to eat them earlier in the crawfish video because they're super, super hot sounding, but the way he cooks them, they weren't that bad. Retake, we got scallion, onions, no, scallions, thyme, and garlic. No, <laughs> not garlic, no garlic. No garlic. All right, so we have pepper, scallion, and thyme in the pot so far. Are you tricking me? Because you didn't say pepper the first no, time. I, I didn't say anything about garlic. I don't know where you get that from. So this is the pimento leaves. We got it from the pimento tree. So. No, we got it. Me and Shark Bite got it. All you right, didn't get nothing. Over. You guys watch this. We're going to go collect this stuff real quick. And in Jamaica, there's briars. Don't think there's not. This one, of course, here is the tree fermento. What do you need, a leaf? Yeah, just a leaf. Right here? Yeah. This one? Uh, yeah, yeah, that one's good. Yeah. Can tear off, get off, couple leaves off it. What do you say it is? Pimento. Pimento? Yeah, this is a type of spice, the leaf. The fruit itself is a type of spice. So like curry or boiling crabs and those stuff. Yeah, and even jerk pork. Yeah, jerk pork and jerk chicken. It smells spicy. Yeah. 
pretty much so these are all we need now we're good yeah everything in this pot comes from right here in jamaica really close to where we're at so you know what's in there we're gonna put the lid back on get it super hot hot and we're gonna wash the crabs all right so all i'm doing is adding water to this bag full of crabs sort of letting them kick each other around in there and then dumping it out i'm sorry buddy but we want to eat you the pot is hot yo no and i can't even want one 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 by one why do I want to get bit nor take that long? <laughs> That's the humane way. How long are we going to let them cook? 17 minutes. 17 minutes, y'all. We'll be eating mud crab. While we're waiting on the crabs to be done, Shark Bite here challenged me a backflipping contest off that cliff right over there. Like he thinks he... <laughs> Bro, we set off the... <laughs> Nope, he won. I can't do it on land, y'all. I'm so ready to eat some crabs. You think it's ready yet? I don't know, it might be. I don't know. Is this twig gonna break? No. <laughs> oh, you can see the spices in there. Ooh, How much yeah. longer? That Four minutes. Four minutes. Look at it now. The crab's right there. Are you hungry? I am starving. This is a nifty little twig you found. I made it. So this little guy right here is one of the biggest that we caught. He got extremely lucky because him and his buddy, we kept to the side to get a thumbnail for y'all, the thumbnail that you saw in this video. So today he gets a free pass. We're turning him loose. He gets to live to pinch somebody again. See you later, buddy. How cool is that? You're so cool. Oh, you're all hung up. Oh, you're going to get... Dude, you should be friends with me. I turned you loose. Alright, so while he's getting the pan empty, I got to try one. Man, they're hard. And hot. <laughs> Super hot. Tastes just like stone crab. Tastes really good. Here, try it, babe. It looks like stone. It's hot. It smells good. Good. It's really good. A lot better than you'd think coming out of the mud, the mud. it came out of. Yeah, there's no muddy taste whatsoever. Mmm. That was good. <laughs> you did good, brother. Yeah. Respect. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys, I really, really appreciate you checking this video out. I want you to make sure to check out Spearfishing Jamaica. And all of our videos, both Kelly and mine, you'll see his information in the link below the video. He's an awesome YouTuber here in Jamaica. Got to thank our buddy Shark Bite. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and our little buddy back here. I'm not even sure his name. <laughs> We're gonna give him a big old bowl of this. We're all gonna eat. We gotta pack up. We gotta cross this river, climb that cliff, pack the truck up, and be back before the curfew starts. So, hey, can't thank you enough for being here, but like my 10-year-old Jake always says, it's time to get up out of here. And get the heck out of what? Shape.